Hi, I am Deshaun coming to you with my plans for St. Patrick's Week, March 15th through March 21st. I am using the Blue Sky Planner, my favorite planner to use, and the stickers and washi tape and pen are from Dollar Tree and from Mambi. So you guys, let's get started. Monday, I have to make sure I call. Monday, I have to make sure I call a driver. You guys, I'm not sure which driver I'm going to use. Y'all know my situation with my drivers. Mm -hmm. And Monday also starts... My oldest, Allison, my chunky monkey, her um, spring break. She's going to have a whole week off, you guys. A whole week. How exciting. I know she's excited. I'm excited. That means we get to get a little rest. <laughs> okay, for dinner on Monday, we're going to have turkey breast and green beans yes yes you guys i i like you guys i am truly a, a breast girl i like chicken breast turkey breast any kind of meat that has breasts i i prefer the breast because it has more meat on it and i'm a meaty girl so, <laughs> so i like the meaty parts Tuesday, I have to work out, you guys. I have to keep my strength up. So I will be working out. And for dinner, we will have chicken tortilla. Yes, yes. Yummy, yummy. Wednesday is St. Patty's Day. I have a meeting on Wednesday. And for dinner, we'll be eating meatloaf and potatoes with some greens. Yes. Yo, my mouth's up in water and thinking about the greens. I love eating greens. I might mean, like eating meatloaf. I, I, if I eat meatloaf, it has to be, has to be with mashed potatoes. It has to be. That is the only way I will like meatloaf. But baby, them greens, some collard greens at that. Oh. With some hot sauce, baby. Y'all let me know if y'all eat greens. And if you do eat greens, what do you put on your greens? Do you put hot sauce? Do you put salt, pepper? Just let me know what you put on your greens, honey. I mean, while the greens are cooking, of course, I use different seasoning. But when they're done and it's time to eat them, yes, you guys, I like to shake a little hot sauce on there and my favorite hot sauce to use is red bull yes y'all red bull hot sauce on some greens is the best thing in life wait is red bull considered a hot sauce i don't even think it's considered a hot sauce i think the name says tabasco sauce on it or maybe it says habanero sauce on it. I don't even know. But I've been eating it for years, ever since I was a little girl. And I've always called it hot sauce, but I never actually read the bottom. But it tastes so good. I know it has the bull on it. Y'all know what I'm talking about? Like Y'all let me know what kind of hot sauce y'all like. But baby, that red bull hot sauce or Tabasco sauce or habanero sauce, whatever sauce it is, it is delicious. Okay, you guys, Friday, listen here, we ain't gonna talk about this washi tape. <laughs> My girls, they wanted to help me put the washi tape on, and um, yeah, that's what happened. <laughs> so that's why it's not straight. I mean, the washi tape, I don't ever put it on straight, because, you know, my body be shaking so much when I be trying to do the washi tape. And I love washi tape, so I got to put the washi tape on, even though it is a struggle 
for me to put it on it like honestly you guys it's a struggle for me to do the washi tape the stickers all of it the writing all of it because my body be shaking so much and it be so hard but i really really, really want to do it because i really really enjoy decorating my planner i really really do so friday is an important day i must say and we're gonna have some tuna casserole y'all let me tell you something with it being spring or about to be spring, we're going to be eating a lot. Do you hear me? A lot of fish. Yes. Yes. Because in the springtime, okay, okay, okay. Y'all know normally in the springtime is when I begin my weight loss, right? But, you know, this winter time and this fall i didn't gain as much as weight as i would like to have gained okay you guys this um past fall and winter time i did not gain as much weight as i would like to have but y'all know my doctor they said they don't want me to keep doing the up and down weight woo -to -woo. so uh, I told myself that I'm going to keep myself like in the middle, like be a slim thick, you know what I mean? So that's what I'm going to try to do is stay slim thick. Um, I have not weighed myself in quite a while, but I have been noticing my clothes have been fitting a little tighter, which I'm excited about. Um... I don't, I don't know when I'm going to get on the scale, you guys, because I'm scared that if I get on it and it says that I'm still, like, super-duper skinny, that I'm going to be sad. But if it says that I done gained all my way back, I'm going to be sad and depressed. So, I, I'm kind of trying to stay away from the scale, but I do want to know. I do want to know how much I weigh, but I'm just not ready to know yet. So, y'all let me know. Are y'all trying to lose weight or gain weight? Saturday, meatball marinara sandwiches. Mm -hmm. Y'all, <laughs> we love to eat this. And there was a time, like a month ago, where I said, I'm never going to eat that again. But I'm back on it. <laughs> It's just that when I start eating the meatball marinara, sometimes I eat too much of them. And I get, you know, bored of them. But I'm back on them because they do taste very delicious. Sunday, jambalaya with beef, chicken, and shrimp. Yes, you guys, I am back on shrimp. I left shrimp. I left shrimp alone for quite a while. And now I'm back on it because, baby, I what I can't even remember what I made. It was shrimp something, and it was so good. I was like, oh, I don't know. I got to get back on this shrimp. So, yeah, I'm back with shrimp. I mean, I'm not eating, like, a lot of shrimp. I'm not eating a lot of it. But I am back on the shrimp, like coconut shrimp, like that. Fried shrimp, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm back on the shrimp, you guys. So, you guys, I have to make sure I am taking my medicine every day, every day. When I say every day, I mean every day. Because there are times when I get up and I feel amazing. I'm like, oh, I feel good. I don't need no medicine. But then all of a sudden, I try to take a step and I stumble. Or sometimes I try to get out of the bed, I bounce back. I'm like, oh, yeah, I need you medicine. But sometimes, some days, y'all, I do feel really good and I feel like I can make it without medicine. But then something happens and make me remember I do need my medicine. Like when I'm in the kitchen trying to do something and I drop something. Oh man, I hate that. I hate that with a passion. I'm like, man, I thought I was getting better. 
But yeah, I just got to keep working out, keep taking my meds. That's what I got to do. That's my life now. It says, you've got this. You guys, I want you to wake up and say every day, I got this. I got this. I can do this. It's me. I got it. I got it. So I'm telling y'all and I'm telling myself, you've got this. Because there are times where I feel like I don't have it. Like today, I almost had a nervous breakdown. I, y'all, seriously, I almost had a nervous breakdown, and it, it, it's a lot going on around the world, it's a lot going on in my life, and I almost had a nervous breakdown, but I had to tell myself, you've got this, you can do it, keep it up, I had to motivate myself. And that's what you have to do sometimes, guys, is motivate yourself. You can't rely on other people to always motivate you because sometimes other people are not going to be around and they're not going to understand what you're going through. And, y'all, that's a whole nother discussion. That's, it, it's, a, mm, I got something to talk to y'all about, but I gotta, I gotta, breathe and move past it and then I can talk to y'all about it because I do want to talk to y'all about it because talking to y'all that is therapy to me and um yeah I'm not ready to talk about it yet but I I got this you guys whatever you're going through believe me you've got it you can do it you got it and that's what I got to tell myself. I'm telling y'all and I'm telling myself, you've got this. We got this. I got this. <sighs> Thanks for watching, you guys. Have a blessed week.